Hey guys, Dion Taylor here. There is another feature that I want to talk about in this particular video that has been added to Dynamics 365 field service. The feature name is Booking Maps and it's available for resources that have a type of user. So the way that it works is on the field service mobile app, these resources can now view all of their assigned bookings on a map. I'm going to show you in this video some of the prerequisites. They're not a lot, so it's going to be easy to set up. And then I'll show you what it looks like from the field technician's perspective. Let's go ahead and take a look. In order to enable these booking maps, what you need to do is to turn on geospatial services, hopefully I'm pr pronouncing this right, in your environment. So you're going to go to admin.powerplatform.com, which is the page that you're seeing on my screen right now. And then you're going to click on the environment where you want to turn this on. So obviously that's just my environment, what I'm, what I'm going to do then is I'm going to click on settings and I'm going to expand this product section over here. And then all you have to do is click on features. So you can see it's already turned on in this environment. So you just need to set this little slider to on and then you need to go ahead and scroll down and then make sure obviously that you save those changes. Then you can go ahead and test this. So I'm just going to go back here to my schedule board. You can see that I've already scheduled a few work orders for myself. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go ahead and log into the mobile application and show you what that experience looks like. And here I am in the mobile application and you can see all of the bookings right on there my bookings right so these are as you can see today monday may 31st if i want to see bookings for for different days i can as we know just go ahead and change the dates right and it doesn't just work for the agenda but also for the booking maps so in order to access booking maps you're going to click on agenda and then you should see that map option right those are the booking maps that you can access, which will now show you your bookings right on that map on your mobile device. So you can see here there's a pin there, the blue pin right under San Juan Hill. That's one of the bookings. And then you also see the number three here under uh, Tribeca over there. So what that means is that I have three bookings in that area. And I'm going to zoom in in a second so you can kind of see um, what that looks like as I zoom in. Now, you also see that there is a blue colored pin. So there's different pin colors. You have the blue pin, which is bookings with the status of scheduled or any custom status that you might use. And then you have green pins. Those are traveling in progress or break statuses. And then you have a gray pin, which is complete status or canceled statuses. Now, if I want to get details, I can just click on that pin. So I'm going to do the top one here for a second. And you can see here, it gives me a couple of things, right? I can see the status that is scheduled. I can see it's supposed to start at like 1.49 p.m. and duration of one hour, 30 minutes. I can see where it is. I can see what the name of it is, HVAC circuit breaker, something, something but I can also go ahead and start my turn by turn navigation from here, right? If I click on that, you can see that it just loads in whatever turn by turn navigation you have on your mobile device. And then you can just click on directions and that will start turn by turn navigation. I can also view details, right? If I click on that, that just takes me to the booking and then I can just review anything I need to review for this. So that's how you can very quickly get the details on those bookings. 
Now I can also zoom in. You can see there is a there's a plus and a minus sign that I can use for that. But you can also use your fingers, right, to kind of zoom in. Oh, look at that. We just saw now that the the three, the number three, is now split up in an additional booking up top here. And then I do have two at the same address. So if I click on that, I see both of those bookings. And then again, if I want details, I can again click on that to get details regarding that particular booking. Now, one thing I wanted to mention, let's go back here to my booking maps, is that we do have the ability to configure field service mobile to be offline but unfortunately currently booking maps will not work if the device doesn't have access to the internet so if you are uh, if you set your mobile device to offline mode while you still have internet access then obviously booking maps they will work, but anytime you don't have online access, then the booking maps are not working. So I just wanted to mention that so that you are aware. I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, don't forget to hit that like button. Also, don't forget to subscribe so you'll never miss another video again. Stay safe, everybody. 